So another feature of this template is I have all of this set up for lead vocal one, and then I'll have all of this set up over here when, if I need to use it for lead vocal two. Effectively, if I'm going to use a second lead vocal channel, I'll copy all of this over and paste it all over into these channels here. Uh, this is because sometimes you'll have a vocal that overlaps, um, and I guess it's pretty precise, but I don't like the idea of two vocals going into the same compressor at once. It's always going to drag them both down, so I want them to sit out completely with their own effects. Um, the other thing is, is sometimes the treatment on a verse and chorus might be so radically different that you really want something completely different for lead vocal too. Um, and of course, you know, often like with Shepard, um, a band I've worked with a lot, they have two lead vocalists. So, you know, of course I'll need uh, two. So I have two, you know, completely independent uh, chains here.